all of you look at about your toes when i am talking try to understand the locations so where that location is located when you see only the image of the picture rather than seeing yourself but you cannot signify where exactly is location at the same time try to mark it yes this is the point if this is the point is there look at about image and i'll tell you the anatomical proper location then you just match it and then to recognize is this is the point number 1 number 2 if do a mistake then you need not to worry when we do the practical that time again you recheck otherwise you just ask me so that i'll tell you where exactly is the location where the maximum the electrical conductivity to be taken place on that particular point so that to be known as a the the nodules point to be known as a acupuncture point number 1 is ta thun ta is the great point to be known as a liver one point which is located on the point one chun proximal to the lateral corner that means is the fibular corner of the nail base of the great toe now this is the inside this is the outside now you look at about the inside this is the liver one for spleen one the outer side towards the on the second toe great toe the point is located on the great toe but one is point is on the medial side that's known as the in pi that is a spleen one on the other end that is a liver one that to be known as a thathun right but liver one having the physiological role that means majorly this is the physiological aspect to be known as a horary point that means is the self governing liver point without disturbing to any other organ when we activate the liver one that you are activating to the liver organ itself directly without taking the support of the any other organs the people says my job i wanted to do the my work is i am doing alone but i don't want any help so in this way so whenever it is voluntarily required to me i can take the support and then i can use it in the same way the liver one point is is the first point is putial point or the jingwell point or the well point or the emergency point right so all the nail bases <coughs> to be known as a neuromuscular junction point or the neuro transmission points to be taken place that is the liver one point that in fact is enhancing the chi and then energy vital force or life force to that particular organ to be known as a liver one so now the liver one major physiology about the whatever the functions and then physiology i told you about the modern medicine whatever i told you the traditional medicine collectively to be known as a collectively to be known as a activate one single point to treat for the thousands of diseases here i wanted to tell you dr u wei ping told that is one acupuncture point treat the thousands of diseases 16000 diseases but in the same way i told you numerous points are existing one acupuncture point treat for the at least one disease i told you but this point one single point you can treat hundreds of the diseases perhaps it is 1000 diseases but 1000 diseases the person he do have it is a exclamatory and then question mark person sir i have diabetes and hypertension and thyroid nothing else i do have how you can signify 1000 diseases but dr u wei ping how he said is the one point is equivalent to 16000 diseases but whereas in because i understand the theoretical deep knowledge about the liver system liver it says it is the it is the it is a chemical factory in our body and also thousands of enzymes it releases 
at the same time the storage of the liver so which is the mother organ for all the organs in our body therefore wherever the disease is there perhaps we don't know what could be the etiology and pathogenesis to cause that problem of course liver also major reason to cause the numerous diseases is it the known disease or the unknown disease but this point i wanted to tell you there is a panacea for all the diseases liver one so therefore whenever you wanted to touch and treat because the liver toxicity is the major because whatever we consume the food today whatever we receive the organic food we say that but of course we are not getting the organic all our inorganic foods we are getting because of the excessive population but at the same time we consume that that will store the unwanted toxins in our hepatic system to detoxify that toxins certainly this point will be useful at the same time according to the western you know eastern medicine the headache is the main reason because of the cord liver system which leads to the problem of the hepatic organ diseases causing the pain on the head related disorders right side headache related to the gall bladder life left side headache related to the liver organ whenever there is a problem on the left side of the head region or the temporal region or the vertex of the head region or the frontal head region or the occipital region of course you understand it is connected to the liver especially on the left side whereas in the right side there is a problem is there that is indicating to the gall bladder because why i wanted to consider as a liver should be on the left side numerous reason for the left side which is communicating and connecting to the left side of the body no doubt the liver is existing on the right side below the diaphragm but also connected on the left side as well but you look at about the you look at about the numerous conditions which is communicating to the hara diagnosis hara diagnosis is the japanese diagnosis which is indicating the liver is on the left side and so on many things we can understand so now Now the liver one is the imperative point to treat for the hernia related disorders in the Chinese terminology hernia says is the shan shan acupuncture shan related disorders there are the seven type of the shan or the shan shan is the spread shan means is the hernia related condition or the musculo tendinosus related disorders locomotor disorders or the movement related disorders arthritis related disorders or the c reactive protein get excessiveness or the ra factor get excessiveness or the uric acid metabolism is not doing well at in our body all the conditions certainly we can use liver one but here you just as a perpendicular you can insert the needle that works wonder but i believe i i respect to my master professor park jao as well but he told that the tonification to be taken place at the same time the liver one sedation also to be taken place but now the sedation to be done when the excessive energy is there in the hepatic organ that time you sedate the energy when there is the less energy is there tonify the energy even you look at about the emotions the person having the emotions is connected to the fear emotion is there always fear belongs to the kidney but according to the some of the authors they believes that when the person having the excessive fear but that means is the deficiency of the liver it it related to the fear complex or the inferiority complex whereas in when there is the excessive liver energy is there that particular time the person will get always is anger irritation resentment rage and you know uh, frustration anxiety thinking all are connected to the liver pathology that means is the excessive function of the liver always we remember there are the two things will happen in our body normally i am good and healthy that means my vital parameters are normal either it is excess or the deficiency it is a neutral level i am moving in the one threshold if the threshold got upward and downwards direction i crosses the road barrier i am coming in the one way direction that means i crossed my barrier that means is somewhere is irreversible of the energy is moving that means the excessive energy is there that making me to go to that level so therefore when there is the hyper function of the 
liver also leads to the various diseases and then hypofunction of the liver also related to the many diseases for example you can see the hyperfunction of the liver the eyes will become very red like a conjunctiva at the same time when the liver blood is deficiency that is indicating there is the paleness in the eye system very very bright eye you can see but the charisma is very less the face you look at about that there is a more charisma indicating that the cardiac system and liver system is good when the paleness is there on the facial region you recognize that it is the liver function is lesser than the normal if the patient is fear complex is there low deficiency of the liver organ so on we on analysis and understand but at the same time we wanted to see the pulse diagnosis then the liver is normal of course is the normal when there is a weakness is there that indicating the deficiency of the blood in the liver when there is a excessive pulse is there on the left side on the middle pulse try to find out that indicating that is the excessiveness is there but the person he doesn't sleep in the night time he don't get the sleep and he don't fall in on the sleep but he always listen with the you know music or maybe he can see the watches the movies or something he will spend the time that he don't get the sleep at all indicating that excessive heat or flares up in the liver system that's flares up to the scalp system where the cerebrospinal fluid will get the hotness which not make taking us to sleep where the dopamine doesn't release precisely where the melanin uh, melanin are uh, not releasing precisely to induce the natural sleep so therefore all these conditions of course i told you the metabolism catabolism and anabolism to be taken place by the liver system therefore whenever the patient feel the people who consume the lot of antibiotics or the medications which we call as a proton pump inhibitors histamine receptors antagonists medications so that time to suppress that antacid certainly we can treat by using the liver one point is recommended to regulate our metabolism as well when the patient having the diabetes condition even that condition also liver one and then spleen one both together combined together it is recommended to use for the diabetes to control by using these two points as well because i understand spleen one and then liver one both the points are combined together that means the spleen one it regulates the spleen and then liver also liver one point it's regulating to the liver but liver also in good control and then the spleen also getting control then the entire transportation transformation of the energy moving of the chi from the all the directions to be taken place blood also stored in the liver at the same time blood is scattered at the same time blood is the storage capacity to be taken place by the spleen as well because when the excessive storage is there that time it will going to spoil the blood because when we look at about the amenorrhea or men menorrhea or metrogia the amenorrhea or the oligomenorrhea both are related when there is no bleeding for the women when there is the bleeding excessiveness all are connected to the amenorrhea is the absence of the bleeding where the deficiency of the blood so that time you just activate to the liver one when there is the amenorrhea is there excessive bleeding is there because the, due to that excessiveness storage in the liver the spleen is not supporting to control the blood because that is splitting from the blood vessels to move out from the other direction that leads to the bleeding therefore spleen one it controls the bleeding so together you just activate certainly the all the women related disorders also so can be treatable by activating this this particular two points is good at the same time when the great to having the problem the great to having certain kind of the fungal infection or any kind of the nails related disorders you wanted to use as a local point certainly you can use the local point once you apply the needle there is a artery called as a dorsal digital artery and then the deep peroneal now that also will support to that particular region to regulate the chi on that level so the person who feels the numbness on that particular toe because of the diabetes neuropathy or you know any related problem then also you are activating to that now to regulate that according to the according to the huato chiachi 
previous week i told you the lumbar region lumbar region controls to our toes as well the great toe to be regulated by the l5 therefore you just activate to the l5 vertebra on the spine region that also regulating to your great toe related problem the person having the uric acid metabolism is weak that time the inpai tatu kungsun tatun these are the points the spleen 1 2 3 and then the liver one also activated for the uric acid metabolism also to be taken place by activating to the liver one point right so hopefully you understand to vision related problem and also muscular related problem sinus related disorders mind related disorders metabolism conditions and local point having the local effect and also the hernia related disorders by the way the problem is in the lower abdomen the patient feel there is a pain on the hypogastric region the pain on the right inguinal region left inguinal region also connected to this particular area even you can use it for that condition also liver one point is always is good to treat for the known and unknown cases of the diseases when when we understand when we understand any problem related to the pain related condition that time if it is required then certainly you can add up one particular point always is good one point is tonification or sedation if you are in dilemma that means you just apply perpendicular the muscle got very very rigidity and spasticity that time you just sedate to the liver system when the liver the muscles are very weak and then flaccid slightly then activate to the activate to the tonification to the liver system